after a crash of Prigozhin's plane, Wagnerites try to leave Belarus for Russia. Following reports of the supposed death of Yevgeny Prigozhin, fighters from the Wagner Group are forming convoys to leave their camps in Belarus for Russia. Ukraine's National Resistance Center and Belaruski Hajun, an independent Belarusian military monitoring media outlet, reported this. The National Resistance Center noted that, as the Belarusian underground resistance movement had reported, some of the Wagner Group's camps in Belarus were being dismantled on the evening of the 23rd of August. The convoys are presumably heading towards the border with Russia, but Belarusian security services are trying to prevent the mercenaries' vehicles from leaving. At the same time, Belaruski Hajun reported that serious disruption in mobile internet connection had begun in the village of Tsel near the Wagner Group mercenaries' camp. It should be noted that on the evening of the 23rd of August, a small plane crashed in Russia's Tver Oblast and the Russians claimed that Yevgeny Prigozhin, leader of the Wagner Group, was on board. The Grey Zone Telegram channel, which is close to the Wagner Group, claimed that Yevgeny Prigozhin's plane had been shot down by air defense fire of Russia. The Russian media saw a certain symbolism in the fact that the plane crash occurred on the 23rd of August, exactly two months after the Wagner Group's mutiny. It should be noted that Prigozhin announced his march of justice on the evening of the 23rd of June.